Bismillah ar-Rahman ar-Rahim. His Excellency Sardar Badri Madhav, President of Turkmenistan, Excellencies, distinguished guests, esteemed scholars, ladies and gentlemen, <coughs> Assalamu alaikum and a very good morning to you all. It is indeed a great honor to address this August gathering to celebrate the 300th birth anniversary of Mahdum Huli Fagi, a towering figure in Turkmen literature and a beacon of culture and spiritual enlightenment. I extend my heartful appreciation to the government and the brotherly people of Turkmenistan for organizing this prestigious event and a promoting understanding, peace and dialogue among cultures. Ladies and gentlemen, Pakistan and Turkmenistan share a deep-rooted bond of brotherhood, which is built on a mutual respect, commonality of faith, and a shared vision of a better, peaceful future. My participation in this conference is a reflection of a com commitment to strengthening these ties between our two brotherly countries. We need to focus on promoting connectivity among regional countries and would help strengthen culture and economic operations. I am delighted to share that one of our founding fathers and our national poet, Alama Muhammad Iqbal and Magdum Guli Fergi, share several commonalities in their poetry and thoughts on Sufism and nationalism. Excellencies, ladies and gentlemen, Magdum Guli is only one poet but a symbol of Turkmen people's spirit, aspiration and love for their homeland. His works, written in the 18th century, continue to resonate with us today, providing guidance, inspiration and a sense of unity. <clears throat> Magdum Guli was born into a time of great political and social unrest when the Turkmen tribes were scattered and divided. Yet despite this challenge, he dedicated his life to the dream of seeing the Turkmen people united as one. I would like to specially commend the President of Turkmenistan, Sardar Badri Muhammad Afi, for organizing this event to promote the works of Magdum Guri Fuegi, as well as providing an opportunity to interact with leadership of the regional countries that would help strengthen our bonds of friendship. I also congratulate Turkmen nations on the announcement of the 2024 as the year of the great poet and thinker, Turkey, world Magdum Guli. I'm confident the discussions and deliberations in this conference will not only honor the memory of Magdum Guli, but will also pave the way of a new avenues of culture collaboration between our countries, let us take this opportunity to reaffirm the commitments to our values he cherished and the work together to create a brighter and peaceful future for the generations to come. I am glad, I am also glad to meet the President Sardar Pradi Bahamadi, who is the son of my great friend 
and former President Kurbagulli Birdi Mamadif, who I had the pleasure of meeting multiple times on different forums. He is not only a great politician, but also an eminent scholar and author of many books. I would like to conclude this beautiful verse of Bagdum Guli Fergi, I dream of a nation united and free where every heart beats with dignity. Turkmen stands strong, their spirits bright, together we shine in freedom light. Thank you, ladies and gentlemen.